this is Super Santa Bell, and today we're not going to talk about how I read Braille. Today we'll talk about how how I play things, um, how I do things with 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 a little bit of help, with, with like a tweak. Yeah, because you can do anything that anybody else does, um, but sometimes we just need to adapt it a little bit, right? Yes. Yeah, great. So over here, so you, uh, you just started learning violin this year. Um, I guess this is the book that the teacher issued, right? Yes. This is the book that the teacher issued, but I can't see that. Right. So we get rid of that. So um, each of your songs this, are. And this is what I'm reading. Yeah. And this is Savonic folk song. Right, and so when it's on a stand and you have to, because normally you have a bow, a bow, right? So you have to stand a certain distance from it. I know you don't have your bow right now, but because you have to stand a certain distance, that's how big the font needs to be, correct? Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm also learning how to read sheet music. Okay. Uh, um, this is my sheet music. Okay. Um, I think so it's very big. I think you have noticed. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oops. What? Oh. You took off one of the measures. Sorry. That's okay. Okay. So, obviously, this is a lot bigger than the book, right? Yes. Um, I see that there are different colors. Can you talk a little bit about how, like, why we have different colors? Um, the different colors are, so... So it's not all black like like the left sign that I have in my hand. Right. So because the music staff is black, if all the notes were black, right, they'd just be too too much black and too much too much uh it's hard to see clearly, right? Yes. And so what you were trying to do to take the rest sign off <laughs> earlier <laughs> is that were you going to talk about oops now I have it upside down. No I don't. So, why are we using that rest, quarter rest, instead of... This one that I have yeah. in my hand. Yeah. So, they're both the same size. What happens if you put the, the plain black one on, um, the, on the music staff? It's like, it's still kind of hard to see. Right? And I put it yeah. backwards. <laughs> Slide that down. Yeah. But when this is here... I can see it clearly. Yeah. All right, and that's why the sharp sign, the F sharp, is also not black. Yep. Great. But it also, the color actually has some meaning, right? I'm also humbling the piano. Yeah. And so we originally started with the piano a long time ago, and we chose one with colors because why? Um, because all um, this is all black um, and white. And what does that mean for you? It's a uh, to play. Why? Um, because there's too much white. Meaning that you can't see the different keys, correct? Yes. Right. So by having it be different colors, and then what happens... I. Yep. So I these have, are pictures, right? Yes. Of what was down here. Yes. Was well, down. Well, it's not here. the same song, but, but it's "Oh to Joy." Right. And so these are. This is in Google Slides, and then you can just zoom in and zoom out, depending zoom upon in, zoom out. which days your eyes might be a little more tired. And then, mm -hmm. what if you want to look at the next page? Just slide down. Yeah. Yes. And this is the second page to Ode to Joy. Yeah. So, and the third page. And you, yeah, there's a third page. Yep. Great. Well, thank you so much for giving us a little glimpse about how you uh, learned to play the violin. Yep. I hope you um, come back for more. And. This is the end of this video. Bye. Bye.